It's time for Rick to meet the hustlers. Welcome. Stand against the wall. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Can we start with a picture? Just to in there. Okay. okay. First things first. Perfect. Very good. Okay. okay. Right, Rick. Rick needs the lowdown on today's con, and the hustlers have got it all mapped so out. We're going to put in a position on the street in front of a bank. There's a drop box there, and we need you to uh, put an out of order sign okay. on the box. Okay. Basically, people are going to try and deposit money in that drop box, and you've got to convince them to give it to you instead. Okay. 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 <laughs> With us. So Rick's got to attempt one of the oldest scams in the book the drop box. Posing as a security guard, the hustler positions himself outside a closed bank. By claiming that the bank's drop box is out of order, he must then convince anyone who arrives hoping to make a deposit to leave their cash with him instead. Take as much money as you can, but at the same time, if you feel there's any kind of problems, let us know. We will be listening. Rick will put the cash in his secure money box and hand the mark an official looking receipt as a convincer. Your ID. Is that okay? That's, That's okay. okay. That's healthy. That's very good. Your ID. Beautiful. Mm. There you go. Good it's time. time for Rick and Alex to hit the high street and get this scam underway. The hustlers have selected the bank opposite as Rick's target. It's ideally situated near scores of upmarket shops and cafes that deposit their day's takings after banking hours. To make his arrival look convincing, Alex is going to drop Rick outside the bank in the Securicon van. This short trip around the block is Rick's only chance to prepare himself to face the public in his new role. Once the scam's underway, Alex will wait in the van nearby, ready to help Rick make his getaway if he gets into trouble. Paul will keep Rick under constant surveillance from a vantage point across the street and is in radio contact in case of emergency. All right, off All right. you go. Let's do it. All right. Wish me luck. It's in a bit. Here goes. From here on in, Rick's on his own. All right, he's in position. Copy that. First, Rick needs to put the bank's perfectly good drop box out of order. Then, position himself with his money box safely between his feet, just as a genuine security guard would. This scam is all about social compliance, and it's now Rick's job to play his part with such authority that people have no reason to doubt him and simply do what he says. He doesn't have too long to wait before someone turns up to deposit some cash. The con is on. Any other way I can deposit? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I can get you to fill out this form and then we'll just put it in. What's the business? While Rick takes this guy's details, another potential mark eyes up the drop box. Um. The first guy seems to be getting cold feet. Can Rick talk him round? One second, wait, I thought, shoot. Okay. One. Disaster. He leaves with his cash. Yeah. Yeah, it's out of order, sorry, you're gonna have to give it to me. Having just lost one mark, Rick can't afford to let the second one go. If you want it to be secured for this evening. Yeah. Can I put this in today, please? Yes, you Thank can. You. Like buses, Rick's marks are all turning up at once. But if that third customer looks and sounds familiar, that's because it's Jess who's stepped in to help. That's how much is it, please? 200 pounds. What's the business? Seeing someone else prepare to entrust their cash to the security guard should persuade this mark to follow suit. So I will be with you anyway. Oh, I love it, right? Sign and print, and I'll give you the receipt. Uh, there you go, sir. Thank you very much. It's worked. Rick and Jess's act has assured the mark enough to hand over his cash. That's an easy 200 quid to Rick. Yeah, of course you can. Thank you. With other marks possibly with an earshot, Rick takes Jess's money so his cover isn't blown. Thank you very much. Thank you. Have a nice day.